hi everyone welcome to my channel my name is jenny and you are in turkey headquarter so today's video is about chacha Ike. yes this beautiful woman you are seeing right here is a nigerian nollywood actress her name is chacha Ike, and she is also married with four kids she married a nigerian nollywood producer and director too um before i dive into today's video let's recall back in 2020 chacha ak announced breaking up with her husband austin yeah the thing really shaked internet and she was saying that is because of domestic violence and all of that but we are shocked that five days later she came up and announced that um her marriage was not crashed that nothing like that happened that um she has been diagnosed of pyebola disorder that's what um she came up to say that time and a lot of people were saying no that maybe the husband has threatened her to you know keep quiet and all of that but anyway, they started sharing their videos on internet. Before you know it, um, we noticed that she was pregnant and she gave birth to her beautiful baby. Now, we wake up today and we started hearing again that Chacha AK has, you know, disabled her Instagram page. Like, previously, last week, she has been posting pictures, you know, on videos of her daughter and her son you know dancing even her own picture of her and her daughters dancing and like a kind of dancing competition since last week but well, all of a sudden her instagram account was disabled and the news started flying everywhere that something has gone wrong so now people now came out people that knows her now came out to talk that um chacha ak um was going through something very serious right now that she, they need that you know she needs our prayer that that was why her husband disabled her account according to what we heard i don't know whether it's the truth or not they said they did her juju that previously that time that you know a lot of people were saying that oh maybe she's taking something she's taking that she's you know smoking something but it's not really true a lot of people accuse her and her husband of you know always you know smoking something but people now came out to say that she, um, she's suffering from something um something spiritual yes that the thing comes and go like she behaves like somebody that is abnormal she will lose her senses and start saying things that 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 is not um serious um, according to the gist I heard, they said, you know, they have taken her to several places. The thing will stop and continue. Now, some somebody now came up to say that they did her juju, that it was somebody in the Nollywood industry that did, that did her juju. Me, I don't know how true is that. I don't know if they do her juju. But honestly, all I'm saying is, let God protect this woman because a lot of people now are so diabolical. Yeah, I don't know. I don't I don't really know what to believe, but I am so sad right now to hear about this because when her um when she put up that story in 2020 that her marriage has broke up, I felt so sad because I I don't like hearing of, you know, all this divorce of a thing, young couples. But finally, um, you know, she and her husband moved on did a lot of videos she continued her acting you know she gave birth later you know always posting her family and today again wake up this morning to hear about this gist like right now they said her condition is very very critical that they need to put her out of social media you know that the thing is getting worse in fact they said someone is not taking care of her kids and you know her husband is doing his best to see how the wife would do and all of that this is what i heard and i just say let me just come and tell you guys right here because honestly i feel so sad about this and i pray god to you know come for her because she just you know touch her and heal her and 
apart from them saying is something diabolical they should go deeper into i know they have money share so money is not an issue i think they should seek help even if it's in abroad because they can afford it but a lot of people are on the opinion that it's something spiritual that i think they said someone is after her husband that someone wants to take her husband from her and the person went spiritual that's what i had i'm not sure i'm not there this is just what i had i just said let me come and tell you guys if i hear any other update concerning this case i'll stay calm and update you guys but honestly right now all you can do for her is just pray for her and her family you know we guys remember that time that her brother came out to to said a lot that the husband is doing a lot to her that they are trying to cover up and all of that because of public and all those stuff or i don't i don't really know what to believe but honestly if you're a woman or a man you're going through something in your marriage maybe domestic violence or maybe physical or um, emotional abuse in your marriage you need to take a walk it's not when one person um be you know being when the next person is being affected so much that's when family members and friends will start coming out to talk if you see families that are going through abusive relationship physically emotionally traumatized why not go to the right authority to speak up for them maybe they have been threatened not to talk or they have you know um, emotionally blackmailed them not to say anything and maybe they feel worthless not to say anything but anyway in essence if you're going through anything or or your marriage is 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 a do or die affair it's better you you guys separate and you know stay away from each other and see whether things will work out and then come back because anybody that dies or you went crazy because of marriage man another person will take care of your child another person will take care of your children like right now if the what i'm hearing is the truth about um chacha ak you can see is another woman that will see come and take care of her children for her why she's suffering i pray god to you know touch her and let her let the family find solution to her problem so yeah this is all for this video thank you so much for watching guys and if you watch up to this moment and you have not subscribed to my channel please subscribe and click on that notification bell so you'll be getting notification anytime i post a new video thank you so much and may god bless you have a beautiful weekend